What's up guys, it's King Daddy DMAC and welcome, welcome back to another episode of Ark Survival Evolved. Woohoo, my favorite part of the day, you know it. You know it, here on the Pooping Evolved server. That's right, that's right, best server in the world. Oh my goodness, so happy to be here for you, for you, making these videos. And I appreciate, guys, the amazing support on last episode. We got the Tear Bird. That's right, thumbs up for the Tear Bird. It's a pretty cool addition, pretty cool addition. We still don't have our mate boost yet, but we were able to get an over level 100. 107 gobble and butterball pretty cool if you didn't see last episode make sure to go check it out it's so much fun <laughs> they're so derpy but at the same time definitely definitely good uses for these guys to be able to float like that unique trait nothing else really has it Ooh, are you a galmimus egg did we just get our first two on video no way amazing amazing see guys see see it just gets so good everybody gets so happy they're like oh my goodness it's art time it's art time guys thanks for your support thanks for going through all these days with me spending your time watching my derpiness it's just the best the best man I'm so happy you got these eggs and speaking of which happy times look what I found I know you saw it we finally, finally got blueprints for the flak pants. What I've been looking for forever so we can ditch the chitin for good. Finally, finally. I've been waiting for this, guys. I've been hunting through a lot, a lot of blue uh, supply drops trying to find these. Yellowing up. Oh, what a glorious time. Finally. So pretty cool, I gotta get them painted up for us. I think that should be cool. Let's go throw our two new eggs in the fridge. Nice, very cool. So what are we gonna do today? Um, I think I'd like to spend a little bit this morning, I just got on, and I gotta kinda do a little bit of my chores. Gotta feed everybody up, and I think I'm gonna go hunt for new supply drops underneath the ocean as that happens. Maybe I'll get to show a few on camera if I find any I think that should be pretty cool and I'll keep my eye out if there's any decent level dinos oh baby check it out check it out red drop yes anything around this scary nothing hurry oh man oh, oh ascendant pronto platform what what Oh, that's awesome, guys. Our first Ascendant. What do you think of that, Sharky? Ascendant. Yes. Oh, my goodness. Check this out. Check this out. 104 Plessy. Oh, I was not expecting to do this today, but hey. Let's do it. Let's get a Plessy. Oh, this is an awesome one, too. Be too far away, bro. You don't want to get too far away. I dragged this one over. It was almost in the winter biome. You just don't want to die here. That's right. Got a hit. Oh, baby. This is going to be awesome. Now, being a 104, I'm probably not going to use kibble on it. Don't want to waste it just in case we run across something higher. But hey, I will take this. Yes. If I can get him closer. It's hard to do by yourself, I have to say. Almost everyone else I've seen has done it in pairs. At least in pairs. So we'll see how it works out. Uh-oh, two pleasies again. Crap. Whoa, 112? Oh, man. Oh, man, a 112? I don't want to kill that. All right. Th 
This is our 104. Oh man, this is scary. Oh man! Why you do this to me? 112? Yes! We did it! We got it knocked out! Yes, yes, yes! Alright, so there's still a 112 around here somewhere. We gotta be a little careful. Oh man, what to do? It's kind of nerve-wracking. Alright, we got a couple longer timers. We're doing pretty good, though. Look at that! Oh! It's gonna be so good. So good. All right, we just got to keep it safe. We can do this. Yes, we got our first plazy. I can't believe it. I can't believe it. Oh, our dossier is doing so good. Only a couple left. Oh, man. Where's the thing? Where's the thing? Do the thing. WMD. All right, what should we name this guy? Oh man, there's so many good names that we could do. I love it. Let's change him over to neutral. Sweet, and let's head on home. I think I might even have some pleasy saddles already made up. Yeah, that I found in supply drops. Oh, you're so awesome, 153, not bad. Not bad at all. Oh, I love my pleasy. Follow me, follow me. Welcome to the tribe. Come meet Kyogre. Come meet Cherry Bomb. Come meet everybody. Oh, it's so good. All right, come on. Can I get in? Yes, I got in. We did it. Sweet. Let's get everybody to unfollow. Let's go get a saddle. Let's go on our first Plessy ride. I'm excited. I've never never had a Plessy before and I can't believe we solo tamed it it is truly a pain in the butt I actually had an easier time taming a Mosasaur on my own than I did the Plessy all right let's see do we have a Plessy saddle we got to there we go there's a Plessy saddle is that our best one let's see all right that's good enough Plessy saddle yes Go, 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 go. Move, Cherry Bomb. Make room for our Plessy. Oh, what a great addition to the team. Let's get on our flippers. Cue that off. Huh. Put on your saddle. Nice. Oh. Look at us. Look at us. Go, 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 go. Awesome. Hey, hey, get food. All right, close the door. Let's look at the stats in this bad boy. All right, Stam's not that great. Melee, though, is 285. Get out of here. Go away. I eat you. <laughs> it's pretty fast. That's cool. So the Stam's not that great. Health is pretty good. 6,700 to boot. Weight over 1,000. That's not bad. That's decent melee, I would assume, to start off with. Give me, eat, eat. Oh, yes, and we got our first level up. What should we even do? I'm almost thinking melee for a while might be good. Melee, speed, health, or stam. I think it gets pretty decent stam boosts. We'll, we'll wait on that, because I don't know how quick it goes through the stam. Let's go ahead and let's start off with melee. You want some too? Oh, and another level up. Come on, come on. Yes. <laughs> All right. So let's see what this guy looks like from the surface. Let's take off our mask. Oh, awesome. Our first Plezzy. Pleasy. 
Oh, you're so cool. Look at you. Look at that grin. Oh, what a mean sucker. Oh, it's so awesome. I dig it. I dig it. All right, guys. So I think we, we've... I think we've tamed almost all the water dinos. What do we need left? We need an angler. Angler ain't no thing. I don't even know if I care about an angler. Give me die. Oh, it's so cool. It does handle better than the Mosasaur. So that that's a convenient thing. I could see plenty of situations where I'd want to be on this guy over a Mosasaur. And it's pretty quick. It definitely is pretty quick. Let's look at how quickly is that stam going down. The stam takes a lot. It charges up pretty quick. Let's go. But it also goes down pretty quick. But you make good ground while doing it. So, I don't know. It's pretty good. I like it. I like it a lot. Oh, baby. Look at that. Red drop. Another red drop. Oh! Oh, oh my god! Mastercraft Quet Saddle Platform. Oh baby, and a blueprint? My dreams have come true! Oh, I love these underwater drops. It's so cool. Yes! Yeah. I love it. Oh man, I'm so happy. I'm so happy. I think I'm going to chop on this mods. Right? Because we're so happy. What level are you? Oh, baby. What an amazing day so far. I can't believe all the stuff that we got. You like my new flak leggings, by the way? I just got them painted up. Amazing. Amazing. Full flak. What's our armor now? We're up to 817. Not bad. Not bad at all. Still, got to get over a 1,000. Got to get over that 1,000 mark. I have to say, though, I kind of liked the look of the chitin, to be honest with you. A little bit better. It just has more detail, I think, in it. But regardless, more armor. Can't beat that. Oh, yeah, and poos. It's got that nice little poo hole. It's the best part, the best function. Just right, right up there underneath the flap. <laughs> Anyway, guys, yes, we have got now, from these underwater drops, three different blueprints. This one we got the other day, Journeyman's Wooden Club. Yes, I want to finally test it out today. Let's go ahead and craft two of them. One of them's going to be for XP. He's on his way over. He said he wanted one. You guys even let me know. Slip might be interested in a wooden club. So we'll see. We'll see what's up. See if he wants one. We'll definitely more than happy to make one for anybody. As far as the saddles, Ascendant. I can't believe it blows my mind it's so expensive it's to the point that both of these are crafted in the smithy I don't know if it requires too many materials that it won't even fit sometimes that happens so I guess we'll figure it out the one main material that we do not have though in this quantity is cementing paste that's crazy we'd need to combine 1500 almost 1600 for that one and then another 11 that's like approaching 3000 it's craziness so i think we need to get on a frog i'd like to get this mastercraft thing crafted up as soon as possible let's go bug hunting and let's just go ham getting that cementing paste sound good sound good all right i'll meet you over there actually first let's wait for xb fancy meeting you here xb mm-hmm <laughs> Always oh, creeping. Well, you know, I just a steady creeping, man. <laughs> <laughs> got to creep. <laughs> I, I got something to show you, man. I first of all, I got a gift for you. Oh, gifts! I oh, fancy. Mm-hmm. Fancy, fancy. And oh, look at it. it. Even it even looks more baller. Ooh, what's this? Oh. Wow. Yeah, you like that? I think I get the journeyman Bronto, but yeah, something is... Journeyman, please. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, those are pretty nice. I don't know if I'm going to be able is... to craft it, though. Yeah, I guarantee you won't be able to craft the 
Ascendant Bronto. That's BS! Mastercraft, I think, uh, I don't think you'll be able to craft that either. Man! <laughs> Why do Smithy this to just, me? Smithy just doesn't have enough spots, man. They need like an industrial smithy or something. Yeah. You know, I think it would be cool <laughs> if they could, they could like program it so that if it was in your inventory, maybe it would also work or something like that. Or like an adjacent chest or, you know, yeah. something like something. But or they could have made it like a dino's inventory where it's by weight. Mm -hmm. I don't know. Did you see the saddle I got from Mimosa? Mm -mm. Send it. What? <laughs> it's an actual saddle, though. Well, I thought Not that's what you're print. trading for the club. What? <laughs> you said gift. I got it on video. You said gift. <laughs> Gifts? It's like shared gifts. So okay. So I gave you my gift. Where? Or you got a gift. Where's my okay, gift? Okay, here, here you go. Don't here. even. Here you go. <laughs> no. Where is it? I dropped it. It's oh, behind oh, you. Oh, there it is. <laughs> what? That's all I have. <laughs> you cheapo. Last time I give you a gift. That's all I have. <laughs> all right, it'll have to do. Sorry. <laughs> Better not come. I was on my way to club penguins, actually, so this is... Oh, you want to go club some penguins together? Ooh, like a party. We could, like... Yeah. Club. Let's yeah. do it. Club party, dance party. Yeah. <laughs> All right. I'll meet you over there. Mm -hmm. <laughs> oh, did you see that headshot? Oh, nice. Oh, is that the sniper? Uh huh. Nice. I was hoping for like 100 million organic polymer. I only got 30. Yeah, I think it only affects like the durability, really. Oh, man. Oops. Bam! Oh, it's so much fun. I don't know why you never <laughs> use this gun. I shot a baby. I thought about bringing my shotgun over. But... <laughs> kind of sucks, though. They, like, glitch through the ground. Yeah. The babies and the... Wow. 34 organic polymer from that one. The babies and, like, adolescent <laughs> and... Just sniping them all. <laughs> it's hilarious. All right, using up all that polymer, get all of our scuba stuff repaired. It's the only annoying thing about the scuba stuff is just the polymer. Uh oh, what are we? Oh no! And now we're out of cementing paste. Need cementing paste. Do we have any more in here, please? Yeah, cementing paste is now what we have the least of. So, I think it's definitely way overdue. Alright guys, here we are at the swamp. I just gotta find a good place to park our quets. But it won't get too hurt. I guess maybe right here, as long as we leave them on neutral, it should be fine. Are you on neutral? You're on neutral. All right, just chill out there. Let's go take Stripe Face. Yeah, Stripe Face. Let's get ourselves some bugs. Oh, man. Where are the bugs at? Where are the bugs at? So, usually the best strategy. There's a lot of lag today on the server. Usually the best strategy is to just kill something and wait for them to come to you. Uh-oh, uh-oh, oh no! Look at all the snakes! Yep, there you go! Look at all them bugs! Look at them all! Holy crap! Look at it! So many bugs! Yes, yeah, so much cementing paste! Go away, thing! I kill you! I lick your face off! That's right, you run away. All right, any more bugs? It's gotta be a couple. Yep, there's one. Shram. 
I'd probably be better off if I went into my options and I turned off excuse me, ground clutter for this. Because then you can see it's a lot easier to see what's on the ground. And look at that. There's a bug. We would have missed it. Guy, I thought I told you, don't mess with us. We're going to we're going to destroy you. You got nothing on us. Holy crap. That knockback, though, is kind of obnoxious. Ow. There we go. You dead. You dead. We all good? I think we're good. All right. So I'm just going to continue hunting. If anything cool happens, I'll cut back in. Otherwise, I'll see you back with a crud ton of cementing paste. Oh, and let's change you to disable victim item collection so we don't get all this junk. Oh, baby, check this out. We got a 116 frog right here. I think this is something we want. Let's go. Come this way. Come this way. <laughs> Let's try and get them back to our quets. Pick them up. Yeah, let's do this. Let's do this. Here's how. I got a platform for my quets. I'll put this froggy on the back of the platform. If I can reach it. If I can jump on top. And then we can just go pick up the other one. Yes! We made it. We made it. Alright. So you're on top. Perfect. Don't fall off, Stripe Face. Let's find where this 116 went. Definitely not going to tame it here. Are you the 116? I think he's a little bit further down. That's a 16. I swore I saw a 116. You saw it with me. I mean, this is it. This is it. I know this is it. Did I get him? Did I get him? Okay, okay. That's gotta be it. Let's bring him back to the taming pen. Let's get ourselves a 116. Yes! We can use kibble this time. We have enough scorp. Alright, we're back. Let's just get this guy in the taming pen. Got him, got him. Yes, I think we're good. Sweet. Let's just turn you on to passive. Nice. Let's get out the gun. Journeyman. Ham. And 116. Yes. Amazing. All right. Let's get this guy knocked out, and then I'll start cooking up the kibble. Come on, in your little froggy face. In your little froggy face. All right, you gonna chill right there? Is he down? I think he's down. Yes. Perfect. All right. And these guys torpor, they don't fall that quick, so we should have plenty of time. Let's see what our score peg situation is. Are you guys still mad? Is somebody mad? All right, we got the hop. We got the hop. We got this. Any more eggs for us? Nope, we good. Let's go check it out. Scorp eggs. 57. We're golden. All right, guys. Kibble is complete. Super sweet. Let's get this all knocked out here. Why not? Why not? All right, so 15 should be well more than enough kibble to completely tame it. And just in case it isn't, we got a few more. All right. I grabbed a saddle off one of our other froggies. They don't mind, they don't mind. And I've already pumped him up with Torpor once, so he should be good for the duration. Let's throw in the kibble. That's right, plus 57. And yes, complete. That wasn't bad at all. That only took five kibble. Very nice, sir. Very nice. So what should we name this froggy? It's super sweet, super green. 
I don't know. I'm going to have to think about it for a moment. But I like him. Oh, and he, he cleared it. What's his stats look like? Not bad. 1,500 health to boot. 722 stam. 230 melee. Not bad at all. I dig it. So we're going to let this guy go ahead, warm up, get some levels before we actually take him into the swamp. The swamp is a pretty nasty place. And you guys, tell me. We got two to name today. We got the Froggy and we got the Plessy. What should we do for names? Mm-hmm. All right, let's get back to our mission at hand. Get on the cementing paste. Oh man, check it out. Check it out. It's another super sweet frog. 112 female. I like this one. You know what? I want to try and have a little bit of fun. Another great thing about the Beezle Buffo, other than just getting all the cementing paste, is it also puts a pretty high level of Torpor. In fact, I prefer it over the Scorpion. But I thought it would be kind of fun. Why don't we try and do a frog on frog knockout? And it's... It's going to be pretty crazy because this is 112. So, let's go. Bam! Now, just like the Scorpion, you got to take pauses in between hits because you're doing quite a bit of damage to the guy every time that you hit him. But that's okay. These guys have pretty good range of aggro. So, let's go ahead. Let's see who knocks who out first. Let's -a go. Now I'm guiding them towards the beach. Just because it's a little bit easier to handle. I don't want to be too close to the swamp. Let's -a go. All right. So supposedly the torpor on these guys, it's not like as much crazy amount of torpor right at the beginning, right at the hit, but it gradually goes up and it goes up quite a bit. I believe even more than the scorpion does. You can see our torpor levels. They're going up pretty high and we're still rising right here. He's already got us to over 400. Oh no. Oh no. Let's get this guy knocked out. Leave me alone. Get a couple primes. Get a hit in on him. Let's run. Now, because of how long it takes for the Torpor to take effect on him, a lot of times it's very deceiving. You'll hit a guy, and he'll, like 10 seconds later, just all of a sudden get passed out. Only from a couple of hits. Oh, 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 that could have been bad. Come on, buddy. Let's go. Get over by the quats. Yeah, I can just tell he's going to be knocked out real soon. All right, got another hit in. Come on, let's go. Follow me to the quats. You're doing great, buddy. Come on. All right, now I'm going to whistle my quats onto passive. Just for a moment, we don't want him attacking the Froggy Frog. Let's go, buddy. All right. We're doing good. Just gonna hop around in circles. You can't hit me when I'm hopping around like this. Can ya? Uh-oh, don't go after the Quets. Okay, he's coming, he's getting close. You can see he's afraid of us. Don't get afraid of us, bro. Oh, this is perfect. All right. Let's J the Quetz over. Here we go. And he's down. Down for the count. Sweet. Oh, beautiful. All right. Let's get all the primes, which I've got a ton of. Ton, ton, ton of. Let's get this guy tamed up. Here you go, buddy. Mmm, those yummy primes. And look at that. 
Nice, plus 55. Super sweet. Yes, we got it. Not bad. WMD. Um. Fofo for now. Fofo the frog. Nice. 167. Let's look at these stats. Oh, beautiful. 1300 health. A little bit long. I, I was hoping for higher stand, but that's not bad. 589. Almost 590. Weight 230 and melee 247. Not bad. Let me get you some food, Fofo. So that's how easy it is to do a Bezel Buffo knockout. It's really not hard at all. It's a lot of fun. And it's fun to see like how how high a level thing can you knock out. I'm going to keep on going. I'm almost up to 2,000 cementing paste, which I think far exceeds what our Mastercraft requires. Kind of the bummer thing, though. Kind of a bummer. It's going to require over 100 slots. I think it was like 120 slots, something like that, in the smithy to be able to do. And we don't have that much room. We only have like 75 so they need to update the smithy really bad. I'm, I'm really kind of peeved about that. Both those new saddles, we can't even craft. That's right, we can't even craft them yet until things are updated. I know it will happen, but I just hope it happens soon with the update. Come on, our devs, update it, update it. We need the cool stuff. <laughs> Holy crap, check this out. Level 112 Dimetrodon. I think I want to try for it. Oh man. All right, this would work. That's a Parasaur egg, right? Dang it, I was hoping it was his egg. Her egg. All right, let's do this. This will be probably the final tame for today. Oh. All right, walking out there towards that rock. We'll come back for it. We'll swoop down and get it. Let me go off, buddy. Man, glad that I checked that. There is another one over here. We need a male to complete our mate boost, but a 112 female? Craziness. Who knows, maybe we could get both. Ooh. I don't mind taking a couple primes. Yeah, this one right here is... Oh, can I move, please? What's she doing to me? What's she... Oh, no, we stuck on that thing. <laughs> they still haven't fixed the parasaurs. All right, this one is the 88 male, but I want the 112. All right, so let's go back. Let's get the quets. Let's scoop it up. And let's head back to the base and tame. Oh, baby. Check it out. Level up. Level up. Speed. Nice. We're 184 now. Getting so close to all that industrial stuff. Anyway, let's take this guy out. I just went prime hunting. Got a crap ton. And I think we're good. Bam. Bam. Gotta do trank darts, by the way, in these guys. They're real easy to kill otherwise. Wow. Wow. Look at how many trank darts this guy is taking. I can't believe this. Good lord! Go down! Go down for me! He's still not down. Alright, I don't think that hit.
Can you believe that? He had no prior damage. And Trank Darts. Trank Darts killed him. What the? I cannot believe this. What were you thinking? Man. I was all excited. I was all excited. All right, guys. Well, you know what? We got a lot today. We got a lot today. We got a Plessy. We got, what, two? Two frogs? We got a lot. And all those blueprints. I'm pumped. I think we're good. I think we're going to end things off here. That would have taken too long anyway. So, guys, please remember, leave those thumbs up. Help support. Help support. And let the art devs know to update the dang smithies so that we can craft all this cool mastercraft and ascendant gear. We need it. We need it. Otherwise, I'll see you next time. Peace out.